is Joe Urbanski with the Total Solutions Group, COO and org culture strategist and still bald. Coming at you with the TAP model, but what does TAP stand for? Well, let's get there. First, it starts with your core. That's who you are, the needs you solve, and the value you create. This is made up of your culture, your strategy, the organization that you're a part of, your department, and the individuals that creatively and collectively come together to do some great stuff in two spaces. First, with your marketplace. This is about seizing marketplace opportunities, and then of course, meeting your customers' real needs sometimes unmet needs, and sometimes undiscovered needs, right? This is at the core of who you are, whether as an organization, as a department, as a team, or even as an individual or solo entrepreneur, right? So from here, we build out what we call the TAP model. So the T stands for true clarity, right? So it's total true clarity to what's really most important. The A is about aligned accountability. And then the P is about purposeful execution, right? But it all has to start with true clarity. And I know you've been a part of initiatives and organizations that focus on execution. We get stuff done, except maybe people aren't aligned. Maybe people aren't accountable. Maybe people aren't clear to what is supposed to get done, right? And we tend to do it backwards. So let's make some sense of all this. So what is true clarity? Why do we throw the word T-R-U-E in there, true? Well, because you can have clarity to your goals, to where you wanna go, to the direction, the strategy. You can have clarity to what's important in your organization, your products and services, but if you are aiming in the wrong direction, but you have clarity, right? You got the binoculars out, you got clarity, that's where we're going, except that's not the right way, well, then it isn't true. So true clarity is step one in this entire process. Then and only then can you get buy-in and real engagement from your people, right? Through transparency and ownership and accountability. And then we move to purposeful execution. Yes, there is a process to actually get stuff done. We can't just jump in and do it. Now, yes, I don't want you to be fire ready, aim constantly, right? This is about get ready, aim, and then fire. How do you get ready? It starts with true clarity. Two things you need here. First is results, right? What's the strategic focus and plan that's fully integrated and transparent? But what results? The results that are really most important. How do you know something's really most important? Well, let's just say we look at your personal life or your relationships or your organizations or your career or your department or the business that you are running. Let's add all the things together that you are doing, every email that you've ever responded to, all the CCs on all the emails that you're trying not to respond to, all of the meetings that you're having, the meetings about the meetings, the video meetings, the debrief of the video meeting and everything else that you're doing in alignment with all the projects the plans, the events. Let's just say it's 100 things. I know you're thinking, that, Joe, that's like 10,000 things. Let's say it's 100. And if I said, how many of those things are important? Maybe half, maybe half of these things, right? Because you know there's things that you did not need to respond to, fires you didn't have to put out, things that you didn't need to be CC'd on. So let's just say half of them. Let's cut it in half. Now you've got 50 things. And I said, hey, how many of those important things are most important. Maybe it's another half, right? Maybe 25% of all the things that you're doing are most important. But then if I said one more time, cut that list, how many of these things are really most important? I'd bet that it's three, probably three things, maybe four, five if you're an overachiever, and lucky that you could actually do five things all at the same time, which most people can't, most organizations can't. You could be great at a couple of things because if you're good at some things or rather if you're good at everything, you're genius at nothing, right? So yeah, you could be good at some things, but true clarity is about what's really most important, the results that are really most important. Then how do you get the results? You've got to have the right capability. This is about the people, the approach, the process. I'm reading that backwards, but that's okay. You got to have all these pieces in place, the capability that your organization, that your department, that your team needs 
to reach those results, right? So it starts with true clarity to what's really most important, the results and the capability that are gonna get you there. Then of course, you gotta build the experience as a part of aligned accountability. You've gotta have the right collaboration and teamwork, and that is where we get to this phase of purposeful execution, which is about transformation. But none of that stuff, step three, four, or five, none of it matters if you don't have true clarity to what's really most important, the results and the capability that you need. So here's my question for you. Do you, does your team, does your department, does your organization have true clarity and transparency and understanding to the results that are really most important for what you, the organization, your marketplace and customers need, what your people need, and then are you on the path to building the right capability that will help you get to the results that are really most important? Answer that question now, let us know what you think, and until then, you can check us out at www.tsgresults.com. I don't know why I needed to say www. You know what this thing called the internet is. Check us out more at tsgresults.com. Find us on LinkedIn. Find us on Twitter. Find us wherever there's an internet available. And we can continue to support you with our strategic consulting, results-based training, and dynamic keynotes and workshops. Until next time, I'm Joe Urbanski.